Oh, you want to race? That's my engine. Shut up! Once there were two young men named Anthony and Ian, and they were expecting a very important package in the mail. Come on, Ian, it's probably in our mailbox by now. I don't get why we have to drive to get our mail. Is it really that hard to put a little hole on everyone's front door? <sighs> All right, who's driving? I don't know, you wanna drive? Not really. Can you just drive? I drove last time. No, you didn't. Yeah, I did. Uh, no, you didn't. Yes, I did. <gasps> no, you didn't times infinity! Besides, I got the logs to prove it. You keep track of everywhere you drive? Yeah, just for time. What like the hell is Big Al's playpen? It's, it's a toy store, man. Whatever, either way, I'm not driving. Come on, man, please, just drive for once. There's a creepy Sherpa living in my back seat. Right, and I'm a gay wrestler. I knew that's what Big Al's playpen was. Oh, come on, man, I was being facetious. Now, please, just drive. I can't. Why not? I broke my foot. When? Recently. Well, luckily you don't need your left foot to drive. I however do, since I drive a manual. Oh, looks like you're driving. I ran out of gas, I can't. Oh really? Because it looks like you're topped off. Stop it! Take my gas! I don't want it! You're gonna take my gas and you're gonna like that! Stop! <laughs> well, I can't drive if I can't see! <laughs> well, I can't drive if I'm not alive! Get out of my car! I'm sorry, what? I couldn't hear you with the window up. If the window's down! Dude, Ian, stop this! Stop! Stop! Oh, look what you did! You broke the friggin' window! What the hell? Ah, Sherpa! Dude, there's a Sherpa in your car! I told you! Alright, screw it, I'll drive! Ridiculous, man. You can't keep making me drive every time. Well, open it. I didn't bring the key. Are you kidding me? You didn't bring it? Great. Now I'm out of gas. How are we gonna get back? Well, uh, I, I could call 911. No, no. I'll walk back and send rescue for you. You can't make it! It's too far! Ian, if I... If I don't make it back alive... I just want you to know that you've been a really... Really... Terrible friend. I know. I'm... You too, man. <laughs> See ya. Yeah. See ya. And so, Anthony Padilla began his long, arduous trek through the barren wasteland. Without food, water, or basic survival gear, he barely made it home alive. Unfortunately, his legs were severely frostbitten and had to be amputated. Yes, times were tough in the 21st century. Any questions? Uh, yeah. Did people from the past really think we would dress this stupid? Help! Over here! Oh, oh! To see the entire video of Anthony's journey home, click the link in the description below. Thanks for subscribing, and why is the Sherpa licking your feet?